Oh, here's the fizz. <laughs> oh my gosh, hold on. <laughs> what the? Hiya! This is the physical therapy. <laughs> Socks. Good day to you, sweet world. Welcome to today's vlog. Welcome, sweet world. No, woke up not feeling so hot. I went in there after I fed the baby at like seven. She went back to sleep and he was saying, mom, ouch, and pointing to his tummy. So I thought he was gonna be sick, but he wasn't. He just came and laid in our bed for like almost two hours, I think. And like He's been cuddled. basically cuddling all morning. Mm -hmm. But in other news, do you guys remember when we went to PJ's four-month appointment the other day. Well, we were talking to the doctor, <laughs> and the doctor said, "No more jump monkeys jumping on the bed." No, I'm just kidding. The doctor said that PJ's head is kind of flat on a certain yeah. side, like her eyes are lined up, and in yeah, that way, her head shapes up. find or her ears and stuff. Mm -hmm. But her actual head on the back of it is kind of flat. Flat. Want to try to see? She's gonna want to look at the camera. <laughs> Okay, so this side is rounder, and then this is like the really so on the flat. left side. The right side is really flat. She favors sleeping on the right side. Right, but it's funny I... because you wouldn't think so because her hair is always so poofy on this side. Like she Sorry. sleeps on both sides, so that's why I don't. I don't know. Yeah. So we're gonna go see if we can get some answers. So when we were down for the baby blessing, Jen's dad actually did some massages on PJ's head, which you guys saw, to kind of help with the plate growth because they are when babies are first born. Their heads are very soft and fragile, mm -hmm. and the plates are growing and forming. And so he did a little massage, a little physical therapy for her, and kind of taught Jen how to do that. Yeah, but PJ's so wiggly, it's hard. Yeah, so she's super wiggly. But what we're going to do right now is... Oh, Hello? 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 Oh, wow. What's going on? So, sir, if, yeah, if you could be in front of your computer right now, then I can show you the problem with your computer on. Yes, I'm here. You need to press that key and hold it down. And from another finger, you have to press the letter R. R as in Roger. Okay. Uh, are you trying to uh, scam me right now? No, sir. You're not a scammer. You're not getting this call from any XYZ company. You are getting this call from the direct partners of Microsoft. What if I don't have a computer? So, Alright, you don't have a computer, you must be having a laptop then. So you just need to be in front of your computer and then I am able to show you the problems and what are the problems going on in your computer, alright? Alright, so I, I will show you that, uh, what am I trying to show you? But before that, you just need to be in front of your computer. And how would you know there's a problem with my computer and get my phone number? That's not true. When you when you will lose your computer, sir, then you will get to know that uh, why people are calling you. There's been no issues with my computer. Why would I have you log in to look at my computer with log me in? Like, why would I do that? As those system drivers will be get stopped, then your computer will be shut down and you will not be able to use it again, sir. Why would you think people would trust you, like, just calling them like this? Are you trying to take advantage of old people? This is something that my grandma would fall for. Jen usually doesn't like it when I talk to scammers on the phone, when they try and scam us. She likes me to just hang up, which is probably the right thing to do. But I'm just like, come on, how can you do this to people? How can you take advantage of so many people? Like, do so much better for the world. That's what I told the guy, and then I blasted Sandstorm. Sandstorm heals. But I just think about like all the people that would fall for that kind of thing. He was trying to take over my computer 
and I was trying to figure out his angle the whole time because it's interesting to me what these people are trying to do. And he wanted to take over my computer and probably force me to like pay him to unlock it. I don't even know. I don't know. It was stupid. The same number called me yesterday and was like, this is the IRS. You are in serious trouble. And all this other stuff. I was like, what? What? The sad thing is there's definitely a lot of people that fall for it. He tried to get common ground with me and then... Anyways, what I was saying before is that as parents, we do have the responsibility to take care of our kids, to protect them, to make sure they're healthy, and make sure they get the care that they need. Penelope might be okay without getting some physical therapy on her head, but it's potential that she could have like a flat head or flat part of her head and we wanted to help her out. Jen is actually taking her there right now to get it looked at and kind of go through that, see if there's anything we can do at home with the baby, and then also if maybe we have to take her in, I'm not sure. Hopefully Jen is able to film something. If not, we'll get the update when she gets home. Hello? Hello? Hi. What's up? Hey, hi, me, horse. You're a horse? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I'm a horse. You had a dream you were a horse? Yeah, I'm a horse. <laughs> That's a good stretch. <laughs> <laughs> Wanna help me get some stuff done? How was your nap? It is. What's your sissy's name? Uh, spice. Spicy? Your sissy's name is Spicy? <laughs> it's Penelope. Penelope. Penelope? Barbie. Do you see yourself in the camera? Penelope? Bobby. Penelope? <laughs> Can you say love you? What do hey, mom? Is my mama here? Oh, not yet. Penelope's at the doctor. Doctor? Yeah. Hey, mom. Penelope's getting her head looked at. Huh? Let me see your head. Hey, mom. She's at the doctor with Penelope. Looks like we got another cucumber from the garden. Hey, my work. Hey, yeah. my are you watering the plants? My water. A, a shower. How about you push it? You gotta use both hands. See? You gotta use both hands. Yeah! Here you go, water the plants. Whoa, 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 whoa. Good. Hey, you watch it over there. There's nothing quite like having a hose. It's an unlimited squirt gun. It never runs out. As a kid, it's one of the coolest things in the world. You can't go very far, dude. Look. There's water in there. Good job. I looked for a way for a second, but basically what happened is he realized the hose can't make it all the way over there. Go all the way over, babe. So he filled up his little canteen and then Brought it over there to water. Stay Our here. lawn situation has been a mess. And since we're technically renting, we were in charge of putting the grass in and it just hasn't grown because there's a big storm that washed it all away. So I've been here just having to weed every week or so. I'm about to just spray the whole thing and kill the whole lawn because it's just like ridiculous. I weeded the front yard yesterday, which took a while. Either tonight or tomorrow, I'll tackle the back. It's pretty ugly. I feel bad for our neighbors. It's one of those things that's just like, Slightly out of my control. What's the verdict? Okay, How did the visit so go? it went well. He was a really nice doctor, doctor. Um, and he informed hey, me about mommy. everything. Look, you're spilling play all over the ground, dude. Pick it up. Play doh. You love it and you hate it's it. It's great and it's terrible. It's great and it's terrible. Oh, sorry. Um, so, like, he's saying normal head size, like, it's like they do it by millimeter, so normal is like between one and three centimeters. Penelope is at a head size. Like, like the way he measures things. Like the back of it. Yes, needs to be like three centimeters is the highest it should be. Hers is six, but helmet zone is like ten and above. So she's not in helmet zone, which is great. Um, we just have to do some physical therapy, and then if it does not improve, we will go from there and see what happens. Um, she's still growing, having growth spurts, so her head still is going to change and grow. So I'm not too worried. I don't think she'll need a helmet, but we'll see. 
I don't see it getting any worse than it already is. But they said if she does need a helmet, it's gonna cost $2,000 <laughs> if the shirt insurance doesn't provide it. Right. Welcome to real life. So. Oh, isn't it just great? <laughs> Those little helmets, two grand? Two grand. Dude, is uh, it like, because it's measured and shaped? Because they have to shaped? cast them Hi. and shape them. Yeah, Hi. I don't really know. So, I, don't, I really don't think she'll need one, though. I don't think she'll need a helmet at all. Do you need but a we'll helmet? See. No. Yeah, when you ride your bike, silly. Oh, yeah, that's true. Hey, man. No, don't put it on the carpet. So, that's the verdict. Just physical therapy. Oh, let me show you what we have to use. Oh, here's the physical. Oh, my gosh, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> what the? Hiya. This is the physical therapy. <laughs> socks. Wait, how Brace. does that work? Hiya. Socks. Um, Hi. Why? So I cover them in a sheet, like a, put like a sheet or a blanket or something, and one has to go like under her arm on this side, and then one's. I don't know. Okay, anyway, she you has better to lay remember. on her side. I know she's taking a picture. I'll know once I like lay her in it, but she has to stay on her left side, so it's like she's being propped up. So that's she when she sleeps. When she's just laying down. Oh, like laying when down. she's just Anytime she's hanging like, out. Yeah. We should have her do this for yeah. Yeah. multiple times a day. So, uh, no, will you help Sissy with physical therapy? What? <laughs> What's Sissy's name? Nancy. Penelope. Yes. What is it? Bobby. Bobby? That's a pretty cool Play Doh thing. We found that for 50% off at the store. It was like ten bucks. How, how many people does it bother you that he's mixed every single color together? Yeah. That's what I want to know. Yeah, it's like that. Mm. I don't like it. <laughs> oh no! Wow! Yeah. Good job. This one is like actually really cool because there's all these different stencils in the actual the thing. Actual yeah. thing. You can get guns. And so it's, and then they sent these, things. which you can. Stamp yeah. And this catapults Play Doh off. What? It's I don't know cool. if we should teach him that. No. And pink. Sure that one's too heavy. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> too big of a ball of Play-Doh. Well, we'll record our physical therapy session and keep you guys updated. Yeah, she'll do one once she wakes Maybe up. Maybe I should do some too. Uh, I think my head's flat. I think it's too late for you, babe. Anything else you want to say while the camera's on? Yeah. What do you want to say? What do you want... What do you want to say to the people? Door. Oh, it's There's your ball? my ball.